everyone, this is Buttercup327. Today we're going to be making fortune tellers. Let's talk about our supply. First, we'll need paper. If it's a square piece of paper, you will not need the scissors. If it's a rectangle, you will need the scissors. I have a rectangle, so we will need the scissors. Now let's talk about our colors. These are the colors I picked out. But they can be crayons, markers, colored pencils, anything like that. And I have a, and you can use a pen or a pencil for our next tool, but you don't have to have one. I'm using one so I can write the color name underneath the colors. But you don't have to do that. Our first step is to fold and cut. If you have a square paper, you don't have to fold fold, but I have a rectangle piece of paper. So first of all, we're going to turn the paper long ways, and then you're going to take it over about where there can be a tiny rectangle, and then you can make a line. Now, you don't have to make a line, but I'm making a line so I know where to cut. And I cut on the line. Or you can make a line and you know like do that and then cut it. But I do it with like how I just did it. Now it will look like a big triangle. Now you unfold it. It looks like a diamond. You flip it over to a square. Now we're going to fold each corner into the middle. Then you flip it over. Now it looks like a little bit of a smaller square. You do the same thing to the back. And this line can kind of help you right here to fold it to the line. And that'll help you a little. Now you flip it over to the back. Now we're going to use our crayons. Let's start with green. Then we're going to use our pencil. You don't have to do this at, at home, but I'm going to do it. So I'm going to write green. Next we're going to do yellow. So I'll do another little circle. Then we'll write yellow. Then we're going to use blue. And write blue. Last, we're going to do red. I'll write red. Now we're going to flip it over. Now that we've flipped it over to the other side, we're going to use our scissors. There will be a line right here. Cut on the line. Now, we're going to use our pencil and write our fortunes. Now that you've done all your fortunes, and if you haven't done your fortunes yet, I'm going to show you a few examples from mine. 
Um, I put one bad fortune, but you don't have to do a bad fortune, but I did one bad fortune and the rest a good fortune. So, this is my bad fortune. Get put in the dump. My next one is, you'll get good grades. So those are my two. Now, on top of every fortune, we're gonna put a number. So it's gonna go one to eight. Now that we have our numbers down, we're going to fold it like a hot dog. Press it down hard. Reopen it. Turn it. Fold it like a hot dog again, but upside down. Now, have my fingers, have your fingers, how I have my fingers, and plump it up. There's your fortune teller. I hope you liked my tutorial. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Have a good day.